Miriam Park held their first motorcycle show today, bringing out hundreds for a good cause. Action News Now reporter Lauren Cooper went to the event that helped feed our community. About 30 bikers have brought out their customized wheels to the Merriam Park barn to help raise money for Meals on Wheels. We got food trucks, we got craft vendors, and we have a lot of great bikes here just to like have a good time and get people through the door to support such a great nonprofit. Event manager for Merriam Park, Mary Vogel, told me she's hoping to raise over $500 for Meals on Wheels. We're doing a donation at the door, and it's just what you're willing to give because everybody has a different level of what they can. And a percentage of the money made by the local vendors, food trucks and concession stand will all be going directly to the nonprofit. So your money goes an extra mile. Chico Meals on Wheels delivers a hot meal every single day to the communities of Chico, Durham, Paradise and Miguelia. Meals on Wheels volunteer Eric Moxon said the amount of people in need of their services skyrocketed after the campfire and the pandemic. Most of our clients are, you know, retired. Uh, they're unable to cook or uh, shop anymore. Um, some are disabled. He told me last year they delivered 57,000 meals to people in need and today have about 230 homes they deliver to every day. And this event isn't just a fundraiser, but a contest where people can vote on which motorcycles they like best, with the winner getting a $150 gift card to spend at Harley Davidson. A great gift for some, especially since some of these riders take riding to the next level. Like this bike right here, whose owner spent $4,000 on accessories, detailing, and renovations for it. And rider Tom Nelson, who turned his used 2006 Road King into this tricked out ride, equipped with around 800 LED lights that groove to the music. I do ride it every day. Did a lot of customizing of obviously, uh, a lot of lights. I got a 1600 watt audio system. Audio is kind of my specialty. We're just out here uh, supporting the community, obviously. Anytime there's any kind of events that uh, incorporate bikes, we'd love to, love to show our bikes and show the work that we've actually done on our bikes. And then there's Gregory Wiggins, who's not part of the contest, but still popped in to show off his wheel. It's called an electric unicycle. Uh, it gets me about like 70 miles on a charge, depending on how you ride it. It goes up to like 40 miles an hour. Uh -huh. Hence the, you know, I, I wear the heavier helmets because it stops me from caving my face in. Vogel told me this is the first motorcycle fundraiser for Meals on Wheels, but she hopes to plan many more events just like this one in the near future. I'm Lauren Cooper reporting in Chico with Action News Now. Coverage you can count on. Chico Meals on Wheels relies on donations and has been feeding community members in our area for 54 years.